Simple gyroscope, coloured differently either side of flywheel to show direction of spin. Mounted in a single set of pivots to allow flywheel to flip direction. Add another set of pivots to allow the flywheel unlimited movement. Spin the gyroscope up to speed, rotate it on an arm so that it travels in an orbit. In one set of pivots the gyroscope flips so that the outer edge of the flywheel follows the direction of the orbit. This is known as the point of minimal potential energy or the axis where the flywheel loses least energy through realignment. It can be seen in the majority of planets in our solar system and some gyroscopic propulsion experiments. While stationary, the gyroscope is balanced on all sides. Move it through an orbit and the outer edge has increased momentum through leverage, seen when stopped sharply. This alignment of the outer edge and the orbit follows the principle of the conservation of maximum momentum for the flywheel. The further the outer edge of the flywheel from the line of the orbit, the greater the leverage of the influencing force to move it. This may explain why most planets spin within 30 degrees of their orbit and Venus spins in reverse but virtually parallel to its orbit. Two sets of pivots or gimbals allow a gyroscope to maintain its original axis like a gyro compass. However, unlike a gyro compass, it has no external power source, and as its energy diminishes, it is unable to keep moving to maintain its original axis, and will eventually revert to following the axis line and direction of its orbit.